Parents, you may have your hands full with kids who are, well, let's just face it, better with technology than you are. Facebook, Twitter, text messaging, I know it's a lot to take in, but you can get involved in their online lives. There are some simple steps to take to help everyone in the family during the teen years. Internet security expert Anthony Mangaluzzo joins us from the newsroom. Good to see you, Anthony. Hi, Thomas. Great to see you. You know, we never stop learning on the job, so I guess the same thing applies when it comes to being a parent. Yeah, absolutely. You know, being a parent now, I'm sure it's like almost like landing on the moon now with all this new technology and social networking sites out there. So there's a lot for parents to learn. And a lot to take in. What are the main social networking sites parents actually need to learn about? The two main sites are Facebook and MySpace. But I would really, as a parent, focus most of my attention on Facebook because it's much more relevant right now than MySpace. All right, I'm going to say something that all the kids are going to be like, oh, no. Do you recommend parents actually sign up to some of these sites? Kids, get ready to say, oh, no. <laughs> I hate to say it, but yes, I think the parents should get on those sites. It's a way for them to experience what you're experiencing online and give, give them some things to talk about with you. Yeah, it gets, uh, gives them a chance to see how actually it operates. Of course, the friends, I don't know if they're going to want to actually befriend their parents, but what are some things parents can actually talk about with their kids? And one of the main things parents should talk about, this is a, a technology that their children use every day. It's almost like asking, uh, who are you hanging out with today? I would ask, I would, if I were a parent, I would say to my child, what are you doing on Facebook? Who do you talk to? What groups are you involved with? Can I see your Facebook account? Simple things like that will let a parent know if their child is doing the right thing course, online. Parents are very busy. Are there any resources that can help them out? Yeah, most definitely. A, a good resource is Net Nanny, which will limit a child's time on Facebook and allow them to view certain things. Uh, ultimately, a great resource, though, is for a parent to leave a computer in the, in the room where they could actually see it and take an active part in their child's life. And ultimately, you have the right as a parent to control your computer and set any security feature you want. Anthony Mungaluzzo joining us, an Internet safety expert. Good to see you. Great pleasure, as always.